some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Previously on The Angry Vet Gets Trespassed from the Post Office. Education is key, and everybody in this post office is going to get educated today. Why would you need to take a picture of this building? Well, I'm working on a story. Well, you need to, if you were working on a story, you need to call the United States Post Office and get permission before you do it. No, I don't. Yes, you People? do, sir. I've asked you, what is your problem, sir? Well, what answer the question. Sir? Answer the question. I don't answer to you, sir. You do answer to me because I'm your boss. You need help. You're not my boss. I am your boss. Yes, sir, you're now the continuation. Will you help these people if I step in the other f***ing lobby? Uh, okay. So, I don't, you know, I don't want to hold all these people up. So we'll go over here and see if they, uh, take care of these people. But now I'm starting to get a little pissed off. There's only yourself to blame. They were doing just fine until you stepped in and started asserting your dominance where it doesn't belong. Acting like you're in charge where you have no authority. Acting like a tyrant where you claim to be fighting tyrants. Huh? I'm fine. What's the problem? I don't know. You ask them what the problem is. They seem to have the problem. See, you shouldn't be mad at me. You should be mad at them. I don't know why everybody's mad at me. Why is everybody mad at me? Are you stupid or something? Either you're joking or you have no self-awareness whatsoever. And I am willing to bet that it is the latter because you don't seem to be that bright. You are also following a frauditor script written by other people. A script with sole intention of pissing people off. So, is it any wonder why people are pissed off with you? Right. I just want to get a stamp. Sorry. I'm sorry. No, you're not sorry. You're doing this just to be a pain in the ass, just for clicks and views, to be a constant nuisance and a disturbance inside the post office. So leave the fake apologies at the door. I am. I'm back. Since they don't, they didn't want to help anybody. So now I gotta, I gotta make sure I get that you on. Came back too quick. She was helping her. Oh, she was getting ready to help her? She was helping her until you came back. Oh, okay. You'll be back in a few minutes. Okay, I'll, I'll go back out. I'll go back out. Please and thank you. Hold on. I'm, go I'm going back out now. I'm going, I'm going back out there now. You can come back and help these good people. Oh, this is, this is, this is going to be a good one. <laughs> why, why, why you got these doors locked? Who locked the doors? That's a safety violation. That's a, that's a OSHA safety violation. Who, who are you? Do you work for the post office? No, I'm just So why are you closing doors and locking them? Why are you closing doors and locking them? You did? No. No, I did not. I think it's on camera. I think I got you I on camera act, locking it. went to shut that door, yes, but I did not lock the exit door. Don't lock these doors. I'm waiting to the building. That's a safety issue. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. I shouldn't be enjoying this this much. I mean, like, come on. Really? 
the fact that you are laughing and enjoying this clearly shows you're getting pleasure and that you are on a power trip, which is quite frankly disturbing by this point. In fact, I would recommend that you go see a counselor right away because there may be some deeper issue with this. I wonder where the, I wonder where the police are. They're pro they probably, they probably, uh, they probably, uh, called the police and the police told them to go pound sand. So, I'm gonna, um, I am going to, uh, Look, they're still not, uh, oh, my bad. They're still not helping the people. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? Here, let me get this for you. Yeah. Let me get that for you. Thank you. Yeah, man. So they're still not. They still not helping. Oh, okay. You're yeah, helping you. They're 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 starting to help now. Now that I'm out out of the area. Look! 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 Oh, it's not locked. Oh, damn. Ain't that a mother. Ain't that a mother. Oh, look, I'm always coming back too damn quick. What the heck? Yeah, you can tell he's getting a real sense of pleasure out of this. This is definitely a power trip for him. This is probably a man who's had no control over his life whatsoever until this point where he's controlling this little area and getting a f profound sense of pleasure out of it. Yeah, I would suggest you go seek help right now. I know you guys hate me right now. I know you do. But I'm actually doing this for you. I'm doing all this for you, 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 and you. I'm doing it for all of you. Some of you just don't understand that, though. Well, can you do this when we're all out of here? You got mm, things to do. But see, it would, I know you do, but see, You're you should be... No, I'm not holding you up. I am so not holding you up. Okay. I'm not. I'm not holding anybody up. Okay. They're holding people up. You know... You were claiming in your post-arrest video that you were not being a disruptive influence on this establishment. Yet here you are being a disruptive influence. There's a word for that, and I do believe it starts with an L. I do believe it is loser. No, 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 that's not it. But it's pretty much describing you to the letter. It would be liar. Yeah, that's it. You're a liar. Yeah, she's helping. I know. You know, you're not allowed to come in into a, um, a government building and video because there are private information that's yeah. going out, addresses yeah. and stuff. So yeah. technically, when the police come here, they are right. be kicking and you out. They, right. They, they, you cannot come in. Really? You are cursing. Actually, you're vulgar. You're irritating uh, really? people, and you're prohibiting uh, service. Really? From being rendered. Yeah, I, I apologize for saying no. the, saying the f bomb. No, it but, doesn't uh, matter. You have to go with this. Point. You know, no, I don't. No, I don't. Yes, you actually, do. actually, that's uh, freedom of speech. Have no, you ever heard of that? Not in a government building. Oh, sure. Not when there are people. Oh, well, you mean I don't? I don't have. A nuisance. I'm not entitled to my rights point. because I'm in a federal that building. That is not your right to come into a federal building and become really? a nuisance. Correct. You can't run into a um into a theater and scream fire, and you can't sit on there, sir. It's not. See now you're antagonizing and you're instigating. No, you're you're. And you call yourself a veteran. That's piss poor. You're antagonizing. You know what's piss poor? The fact that you are uneducated. Oh, now look who's talking himself. 
a man who follows a script to the letter rather than going out and doing his own research. Speaking of research, I bet you didn't even make it past the first five amendments without realizing there are 27 total amendments and seven articles in which the uh, operations of the government are laid out. But nah, none of that stuff is important. He's an educated man. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. You don't. You don't think? Uh, I don't. I doubt the police are even going to come. To be honest with you. You should call them. You should call the police. for the police to show up. I doubt they're even going to come. Let's take a walk outside and uh, get some fresh air. All right, it's in. Somebody. Oh, shit! I'll be good. Okay. Karen on her phone. There's Miss Karen calling the police. She's, I think she's getting educated as we speak. Go hear what she has to say. Excuse me. I'm going, you going out? Can I hold the door for you? You sure? This is gonna be a good one. You all are gonna love this one. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of editing on this on this video. Ha 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 ha! Yeah, all you did was cut it up into three parts. That's all. I would suggest you talk to someone more experienced, such as oh i don't know denver metro audits considering he just got exposed for his dirty little technique of editing out all the antagonistic parts to make himself look like the innocent party um so i I don't know what the address is. All I know is this is the Essex branch. And uh, we're over here off the uh, Eastern Boulevard. And uh, well, I don't know what this road is. What's the name of this road? This one? Yeah. I might be able to zoom in on that sign. I can't. Taylor Avenue. Taylor. We're on the corner of Taylor and Eastern Boulevard. And, uh, in Essex, at this crappy post office, you would think, you would think that these, these things have been happening for over a decade. Over a decade! 
and these postmasters still don't know this? What the fuck? So, I'm just giving, giving these people some space right now so customers can actually get their shit done. Um, I, I, I really think I should probably stay in there, but I don't know. Well, now, it seems like you just spilled the beans on what your intent was in here. Your intent was to cause a disturbance. That is the gist of what that final statement was in this part of the video. Anyway, that's the end of part two. I will be posting part three tomorrow.